show to Brawlhalla can handle this brand new legend of the game. Yeah, so all, all the so, other Again, Toe said to fix it in 90 seconds. We are legally allowed to go this beat is, him up. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyway, back to the game <laughs> where people are actually beating each other up. It's going to be Sandstorm and Money Holla in game two. Yep. Uh, yeah, there was a very close first game. Oh, Ooh, where wait. Was, where was Bro going for that one? Yeah. Still able to come back, but I'm not sure. Oh. This one's looking like stock one to me. Okay. Oh. It really felt like he lined up that uh, that ground pound well, too, but that was a very good usage of the recovery. Right. Stock one going fully into Sandstorm's way. If he can go ahead and end it right here. Yeah, where are you going to go? Yeah, Just right. lined up with the wall. Easy down here. Good stuff. counter hit, though. And again, this offstage is really where he's been making his money. Not Money Hollow, though. He's able to come back right now. Disarm comes through, but Sandstorm gets the starve going. Oh. Okay. A lot of exhaustion coming through, like the sweat beads, and uh, no uh, confirmed like sharking from underneath quite yet. Big Man. swings though get missed. I need to see that hit because he really likes that. Oh, yeah. that was nice. What I may got the Brett Favre type aim mm. right there. Retired just to come back and throw once more. You but. know, he's like, I still got those. Play back <laughs> in this game, especially if it is a read into the full bridge. Okay, Sandstorm right. jumping out there, getting right out of that uh, immediately. Trying to line up maybe a sidelight recovery. Okay. Oh, double Initiating toss. with the toss. Yeah, I like that. Sandstorm not able to find the converting hit, though, to get the KO. Very, very close right here. And that could be the whiff punish that makes it game two. It's very, very close. Sandstorm will find the weapon starve after the disarm as well. And it might be a Sarah to do it. It's close again. That defense is paying off for uh, Money Hollow right now. Yep. You know, he's getting close to that deep red, and he's still uh, in this game. And as I said, man, if he can find, it doesn't matter. <laughs> a, few, uh, a few bridges going with the great sword, and then it's like, that's basically the extent of the trade that you get from there. Sandstorm trying to get something going right here. Gauntlet's at, in action. And once again, no whiff punish. But I mean, either way, as long as uh, Sandstorm's staying relatively healthy, he's probably feeling pretty okay in this position. Oh. Nice. Once again, no dodge from Money Hollow. And yeah. the uh, great sword as right. far as like, if I can get one read, like, there's so much more damage that I can get uh, immediately. Oh, totally. And totally. so, yeah, Sandstorm, oh my god, he is dancing around him right now. What can he do? All right, has to get that recovery to get back to the stage. Nice weapon pick up here from Money Hollow, but he is suffering here uh, on the damage okay. side of things to Sandstorm. Sandstorm back with the act, uh, with the scythe in hand. What can he do with it? Yeah, I'm wondering oh. if that's the swing that Damn. comes through. <laughs> like, we hadn't seen it in a minute, right? Yeah. Like, but able to get the stock after that miss either way. And Money Hall is going to stick onto the great sword as well. Yeah, that was uh, and Sandstorm with the with the in-place air dodge. Like, there we go, bro. Like, that's why like, the neutral air dodge is uh, definitely going to get him through. I don't think he got, a, like, a hard punish off that, but it was cool to see. Regardless, another one? No, he's going to get through that. But, the yeah, it's going to be a clean... Clean pick up there. There's no hey, way he's dude. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Any break dance on it. That was two boots to the head. Yeah, I need it. Money Hollow stats right now on uh, the uh, SIG are going to be up. Like, it's like 70%, 14 stakes thrown. Like, <laughs> what's yeah, going on here? On the free throw line, looking good. Here we go. Money Hollow starting to come back into this game, but this damage means it might be a little too late for game three. Let's see, though. Oh. Damn. Well. Had to do something to try to get a little closer to that stage. Did it work out? It seems like it did. And he also fought wow. his way back to the stage. What a yeah. good recovery there from Money Hollow. But no, it's not like that at all. An actual, an actual tea party. He was drinking some tea. It was, it was herbal. He's, he's it was enjoying herbal. a nice Earl Grey at the war. There's nothing wrong with a turtle anthropomorphic creature. It's probably green, a nice tea. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. Oh. Hey, wow, that was green's great. actually healthier for you if y'all didn't know. So you know, yeah, yeah just okay. you know, a little food for thought. Anyway, <laughs> you think he calls them game. chai tea because everyone gets mad that it's tea tea. Is that what chai means tea? Are you for real? Yeah. Oh, so it's a tea tea latte. Don't you remember that? Do you watch Spider Man? Yeah, that is Spider-Man. Yeah, I forgot they do. And he got that. really mad. He's like, "Oh, you have a TT latte." Feeling like oh. he's about to, you know, dodge out, but instead was able to still bridge the second two parts. Caught Sandstorm by surprise. Sandstorm right. now starting to get caught up, but not too much. Good recovery. I don't know about that mm. TK. Yeah, that's such a long button to go for, even if it brings you a little bit closer to the like stage. No. And it's nothing like this. Okay, <laughs> I will never be them. You know. <laughs> That's, yeah, I, I, yes, 100 percent will never be there. So, <laughs> but it is nice to see some very, very high level brawlhalla, the weights, the baits, all that good stuff. We'll see what we can do here uh, to go ahead and close up this <gasps> game for one side or the other. Money Hollow is still definitely in it, but he's starting uh, to bleed out for sure. Right. Perhaps running out of a little bit of runway. Big uh -oh. bridge right there, and that sent so far away. Sandstorm has to recover right now, but Money Hollow has to go pick up the weapon to really stand a chance of threatening anything. 
That was a good window for Sandstorm to find the reversal hit off stage. That might be enough, and it is. Uh, the ground pound, though, to go ahead and hit it uh, on the ground. Covers a lot of space to him. It's a pretty big hitbox down there. Right. Probably caught Sandstorm by surprise, but yeah, that first game going over to Anime Fan again. You know, if uh, stats show correctly, he is trying to get his first W here onto Sandstorm. At least record a W for the stats. Yeah, and I mean, I think what you mentioned earlier is pretty potent as well, right? Like, the tempo of, of the matches as a whole with Sandstorm might go in this position where Sandstorm drops a game one and then starts to readjust to uh, the opponent he's facing off on. But Anime Fan is looking like he is just staying pedal to the metal the entire time. Yeah, no time for the... Uh Time to like actually back down here. Yeah. Okay. Wow, nice. Okay. Found an anime fan without a weapon though now. A little bit dicey. Good spawn though. Okay. Sandstorm. Gotta get back to the stage one more time. I like that use of this down. This down here to, to recovery has been uh, something I've seen a lot uh, throughout this weekend with the goal. It's pretty right. nice little uh, confirm, but didn't get over far enough to try to get that recovery going. Okay, big scythe hit. Damn, Not still living. To, yeah. <laughs> Next one, though, surely. Okay, there is yeah. an anime, which what looked like it should have been the game for Sandstorm. Yeah, I mean, with the way that uh, he hit that super fast fall, but still managed to get back under Sandstorm and then also drag him down twice. Easy pick up with, uh, the, even if it traded, even, uh, easy pick up with the ground pound, mm -hmm. pushing Sandstorm just a little too low to be able to make it back. And that's kind of like the beauty of the stage again, you know, small wall, not really much you can do to mix up your recovery uh, to at least touch the wall there. Uh-oh. All right, yeah, we are playing oops all edge guards for just a moment. Let's honestly, see. big hit. That might be enough, actually. Sandstorm is all the way there for it. We are tied up one and one. Well, going unpunished, but Sandstorm with the throw. Can't pick up the sights, so swaps over to the gauntlets right here, but it might be close to a stock. Anime fan looking for it. That down take, I don't see it too often with Onyx, but definitely looks like it's supposed to have super armor, and thank God it doesn't. Thank you, Brawlhalla, <laughs> for like not allowing that to be a thing. Yeah, we no longer want to think with Ration. Gets a whole stock for this. It's so close. Oh, my goodness. Okay, you can chase dodge up, so you do get wait. to find the reversal. Sandstorm, no way. Are you kidding me? Nice. Oh, wait. And the turnarounds are so quickly, too. So, like, when someone finally whiffs something in their combo, the other person's able to start there. Exactly. Like immediately. Exactly. Sandstorm looking for that jump out the corner, and that was actually very good for uh, anime not to. He would have put himself right off the stage. Not okay. going to be enough for the stock yet. Sandstorm yeah, and you saw recovery again. Mm -hmm. Like, next one's easily a KO, but... <laughs> he is looking. Rip. Yeah. <laughs> I don't blame you, dude. Okay. Yeah. Oh, there yeah. it is. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it was that I'm being edge guarded currently. <laughs> yeah. And it hurts really bad. Ow, please stop. Okay. Uh -oh. I don't know if I like this anymore. Um, okay. I'm back on stage. Well, you know, I, maybe sometimes they don't always win, though. <laughs> yeah. Sometimes they don't always, that's good always win. That's just good writing, though, when they don't win. Yeah, that's uh, that's one of my favorite uh, things where it's like, all right, yeah, you powered up, but you're still not enough. Okay, go back to the drawing board. <laughs> kind of why I like Pokemon so much. Ash never really won until, until the end. Long until time. the yeah. end, I will say. But oh! oh, no. Okay. Exhausted. Has to dodge. Touch the wall. Really nice threading the needle right there. Gets a good spawn as well. Anime fan with a shot. Oh. Wait. Ultra Hold. Instinct. Hold. Boop. <laughs> oh no! Hold. Pause. Okay. okay. Got through that one, but I mean, it might be rough right here. Anime fan underneath, but yeah, there's only like a jump or two left in the tank. Okay, but we've seen this. This is kind of like the same situation we were in before. Yeah, Sandstorm has to close it right now. Anime fan. Wait, <gasps> wait. Okay, yeah, hey, he needed that step back. Because if that hit, it was definitely over. An anime fan is finding some momentum. It's going to get jabbed off of Panic that disarm. weapon, though. Uh-oh. Anime fan has no weapon right here. It's nothing versus Scythe. The dive kick is just too short. Step for game number one. Java, no surprise, has been all up on that dust game. Good double there to start things off. Mm -hmm. Definitely uh, was looking for a little bit of a cheap stock right there. Got a couple of those pogos, but it wasn't able to follow up with anything else. But now Sandstorm back on the stage. Look at that aggression. Ooh. Ooh. Nice down. So going to go for that forward bounce. Will disarm Java. Java not able to get up for more boots. Looking like a sneaker freak over there. Ooh. Nope. Orb sending the oh. other way. Sandstorm jumping right over. I'm really surprised that Donsik did not hit. Looked like it was really close to Java's hat, but didn't find the hitbox. That one will down. Just a consistent KO tool. Gravity cancel down heavy. That's going to be a big punish coming out from Sandstorm. Mm -hmm. There we go. Now the edge guard attempt here. Java getting into those sweat beats. 
All right, there we go. Kind of gets on the stage for free, but that's fine. Sandstorm has a lot of resources available, having a whole nother stock to play with here. And going to keep that pressure off Java in a very tough spot. Will lose that stock. A little bit of pressure along that wall to just make Sandstorm think twice about, you know, where they're going to recover. So pretty much it was like a checkmate scenario there for that second stock. All right, Neutralite coming out from Sandstorm. Ground Pound coming out from Sandstorm. This one's even again. Mm -hmm. And now here we go, keeping those battle boots equipped, which I think is the right play here. But now we got that orb. And honestly, Java's been doing really well with the orb in this game. Yeah. Uh-oh. Okay, does find a way <laughs> back to the stage. I was going to say, that might be the game right there. But Whoa. Java, where are you going? No! Scared no! off stage, and Sandstorm's <laughs> going to take full <laughs> advantage. Two dares and a ground pound. and All the way up in the air. Oh. Poke, poke, poke. Okay. Good spacing there. Avoids the down sig. Java not finding too much damage, though. Just a couple neutral lights. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Yeah, you just kind of walked into that one because he actually turned that or aimed at the wrong direction. Nope. Okay. Oh. Caught him falling. He's sweat beating. Yep. That's the stock sandstorm. Piece of damage that is delivered with him not being able to answer any of that back. Mm -hmm. Marky move. Definitely uh, on a bit of a tear. Sandstorm Ooh. has to kind of make some big plays. That was not the big play we needed right there because it's all the Marky Moose show right now. Yeah, I mean, you could see he was trying to go for it with the slide off as well. But, I mean, Marky Moose just so clued in to what Sandstorm wants to go for on that flow chart. But here we go. Try and wait right there. Marky Moose threading the needle. This damage is looking insurmountable, though. Exhausted. Sandstorm has to touch down right here. Looking for Pate. Maybe to just defend the weapon spawn. Maybe just defend his stock. Oops. Off okay. stage. This could be the last interaction potentially, but Sandstorm hanging on for just a moment longer. Big signature comes through. It's not enough for the KO either. Slowly slipping away from Sandstorm, just barely outside of the blast zone right here. But Marky Moo, opportunity to end it. And he's going to do it in style. The weapon throw comes through. Uh, we and get into yeah, our next game. And uh, this could potentially be the last game for uh, Sandstorm here in uh, this bracket. Raiders can keep this uh, type of gameplay up and also clean up those stocks at the end a little faster. Okay, Radish off to a good start so far. A lot of patience, a lot of grace given to Sandstorm to be able to come back to stage, but that's a big whiff right there. So Sandstorm gets the action going over here on the left side once again. Oh. Oh, okay, good spawn for Radish, actually, to try to just get out and reset for a moment. All right, Radish is going to go ahead and put a little more damage here on uh, to Sandstorm, but he is definitely hurting already mm -hmm. on this first stock. Going to fight back just a little bit here. Going to get them back on even footing. Sandstorm doing a really good job of uh, control. Oh, that was a great nice. weapon toss. Yep. Okay, Close also wait the angle. Radish was able to fight his way back right here. Good. <laughs> that was the air dodge Sandstorm was looking for in the previous two games as well. Finally gets it handed over to him, and that's first strike. Yeah, kind of needed that. And now Radish is going to be trying to get back into the game as quick as possible. Some side uh, lights coming out. He's that down light to recovery. I just don't think he has the damage for it just yet. Oh, oh, good pick. Oh. Yeah, once again, Radish trying to challenge on the way back. Sandstorm is clued into this now. Okay, sneaks under Sandstorm and also manages to grab that orb. Now he's most likely going to look for that side light Sayer to go ahead and finish things off. Maybe get real American with it. Hold on. Uh, I wish. It's still possible. It's still possible. Anything can happen. All right, right out. Okay. okay, gravity cancel for the setup against the wall right there. Radish able to find the pickup necessary with that recovery. Some signs of life are coming through for the 3-0 potentially. Yeah, he's got to do some damage right here, right now, though. This is a lot that he's already taken. All right, trying to get that little walk forward. Neutral lights uh, going. Going to get jabbed from across the screen, though, so nothing wrong with that. However, though, get picked up immediately. Sandstorm definitely activating right now. Gamer leaned forward, locked in right now. Oh, yeah. Okay, drifting right on down right here, walking up on him. Side light, side air once again from Radish, rolling on up, and that promotes the edge guard as well. I love it, give him the foot for a second. How about one more? You saw the air dodge come through, mm -hmm. but it's not gonna happen just yet. Sandstorm playing on the back foot right here, but still with a stock to play around with for sure. Bro is moving and grooving too around this map. Got the stepping on him, he's got the uh, American oh Classic. Gosh. And that was the American Classic right he out right up there, on bro. Him with the insurance fraud for just what? a second, dude. The bike say him through, I said, I have a dash cam, my friend. Uh oh. What's going on here? This game, I mean, the first two stocks really into the way of Sandstorm, but he has kind of slowed down to pretty much a crawl. Look at the momentum that Radish has right now. 
gets the gets him unarmed because he threw the weapon, didn't repick it back up. Chase down. Yeah, okay. And just like that, Radish has basically actually in <laughs> exactly equalized this game now with a slight lead. Sandstorm just gets it back with that little attack right there. But it's really anyone's battle right here for a game three for Radish. Sandstorm finds the pickup right there. Good spawn allows for the follow up as well. Wow, dash jumping underneath the scythe throw, but Sandstorm Ooh. will Apocalypse scout again. it. It is, yeah. yeah. I was, yeah we it, back. It was the music. We back. What happened? What happened to the Demon Island? Brother? <laughs> Bring back it, was, the island. it was very, you are right. It's so segmented. It was Demon Island in the morning, and then we went to, where do we go in the other one? Uh, Small, Small World's Orchard, End. Or Small World's End, yeah. and then we went to Apocalypse all day now, so. All right. Oh, okay. A little off the mark right there for the side air, but not at the mark for Sandstorm side air. Double weapon toss. He's going to have oh another my. one in his hand. He sent a mad far with that. Hold <laughs> on. Okay. He said, you're going to go do your chores. Go mm. get the mail. All right, Sandstorm now. With the uh, the gauntlets in hand, yep. the, or hand, hand right here for uh, Raidish, does feel like that's kind of the definitely the weapon he's still favoring uh, here. But I want to see some of that uh, that boots magic, if you will. Uh oh. Okay, Sandstorm was unarmed right there, so not going to get first strike quite yet, but looking real good. Sight's going to find its way out. That was a perfect setup, but was just uh, going for the down like gravity cancel, facing the wrong direction. It looked like so. Oh, big swing and a miss. That's going to be close to first stock right here. Next whiff punish does it. Absolutely. Sandstorm knows it right there. Jabbed up and sent into that blast zone. Get him out of here all the way from, uh, from, from almost the middle of the stage, really. But so that means, this means he had quite a bit of damage there. However, got to see if Raiders can find himself a weapon. Mm -hmm. He's kind of struggling right now. Does find it. Able to sneak that one away. And Sandstorm keeps his. Oh, I don't, got the weapon Ooh, and immediately yeah. said, I don't want those. And he gets to keep that one too, so Weapon Star. But I mean, look at the damage on the top right, TK. Sandstorm's looking rather healthy here. Mm -hmm. okay, Raid is finally getting back down to the ground. Nice. Not enough to uh, finish him off, push him off that side of the stage or the blast zone yet, but he can try to set up one more in that same position. Oh! oh! Caught him trying to jump over. Real American hours. Anti air and the ruler, man. That's a, that's a ski shoot. That's a ski, that's a, <laughs> that's a ski shoot right there. <laughs> Pull. Okay. All right. Just like that, all it takes is an eagle and a dream, mm -hmm. an American dream, for Raiders to be able to bring this one back, close it out in four. Is he able to do it though? I mean, like, again, there's been a lot of these moments where like there's just a big burst of momentum for one side or the other, and it looks like that burst of momentum is on the side of Raiders right now. He got mm. that. Got that American power up, and now he's taking it to the bank. Okay. Hopefully of America, anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully. Hopefully. Okay, covering his tracks right there. Sandstorm sends it all the way out there. Radish able to get a little bit of a get off me option. Side lights there, not enough to do it, but this is great positioning for the next one. Is it going to be a drop down right here? Do we get to see the foot? We don't see any of it. It's just a simple Sare, and Radish has regained the lead. Ow. Yeah. Radish trying to get back to the stage, and yes, does manage to do it. Sandstorm with the big chase. That was a uh, very good little pressure uh, sequence he tried to do. Nice. Very okay. Nice. Down, uh, down light, no active input there to push him onto the other side, and then immediate side air to uh, push him away. Oh, oh okay. Are we remixing this? Mm -hmm. DJ. Wait a minute. Uh, Got to stop throwing those boots <laughs> away. Amelia gets him, and he's like, oh, I think you're going to go back to middle stage. Sandstorm just stays under that platform. And now Sandstorm definitely starting to cook on this stock. Mm -hmm. Okay, could jump away from Radish. Okay, a little bit of a resetting tool right here, but Sandstorm still just stuck right on top of Radish. Neither player able to find an actionable button to really get the action started right here. Sandstorm with one. There's Radish with the counter hit. Uh -oh. oh. Getting thrown down to the ground. Where are we going? Scooped. Radish Jeez. starting to take some damage. Yeah, look at the, look at the color on him right already yep. in the red. Oh. Didn't give that dodge no up in the way that normally Sandstorm is looking for, but he has to watch out. I think the next one of those is probably it. Sandstorm moving. Wait, hang on, Radish oh. now. Opportunity. Trying to catch right there. Sandstorm barely able to get out. Uh-oh, and he lost his weapon there, but does manage to immediately grab some boots. He has not been feeling the boots right now, though, so I don't know how long he's going to keep these oh, okay. weapon <laughs> toss. Right away, yep. Okay. okay. Gets the, uh, the... Oh! Sandstorm overextended! That... I think that might have just been able to be a recovery for the W. Yeah. 
Okay, oh, instead, living. is it going to be a game five though, TK? I don't know. The one weapon throw of the boots where it works out right there. Cover on the top. Sandstorm, not able to get it right there, but we switch it over to the other side. Weapon mm. throw will come through from Sandstorm. Yeah, one ounce of, uh, of, of Soju in him. And, well, that's right. Different beast. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> so we got game five coming up, folks. Sandstorm on the verge of reverse 3 0 over uh, Radish. Radish was looking pretty solid right there, but Sandstorm locked in. Mm -hmm. All right. Sandstorm, as uh, you know, as you say, yeah, definitely somehow locked in at the very end of the set. But like, hopefully, I, I don't even know what like really changes. Oh my some days he's playing like the goat, and some that's, days he's like I'm just kind of messing around. That's goat play right there. That's goat play. That's goat play. That's goat play. Yeah. Yeah, we in real goat hours right now. Said bald eagle, goat. Nah. <laughs> Better animal for sure. Here we go. <laughs> now that we yeah, very hot start for him though, and Radish, you know, slowly but surely maybe kind of, kind of succumbing to the pressure. But he definitely still has enough room to get back into this game. There you can see him kind of whittling his way back in. Nice little three-piece, but the uh, come down from Sandstorm. Mm -hmm. Get right back into the mix. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, Radish cannot afford to be taking these trades, though, especially playing this far behind. I don't know if that was an, incur uh, an accidental input right there, but either way. And that one wasn't. Nah. That one was for America. Yeah, again. that was for sure. He was like, let's see it again. <laughs> Neutral. There it is. Yep. No one's pressing buttons until it's finally, finally hit that button that is going to push you off the stage, but can't push you past that uh, stock yet. Think that was a potentially a down air starting, but got snuffed out by that side air. And it's going to be enough this time. Okay. Oh, yeah. Yeah, from the side of the stage. Going to throw that all the way up. Reset the. Yeah, no, I'm actually going to keep the orb. It's always the orb. Why am I even, why am I even believing It's always been you. Yeah. It's always been you, orb. How could I ever doubt? And then it, when it's those uh, when it's those boosts, it's anyone but you, okay? Yes. Like, hey, uh, I don't know if these shoes fit, yeah. so uh, I'd like to speak to a manager, please. Here we go. Gravity cancel side air. Not going to connect. And Storm gets a lot of mileage out of that. And that's the GC breakdance to make it. Last stock right here. Sandstorm has fully turned the corner. Yeah, Sandstorm again. One Now one game away, one stock away from completing the reverse three. And then on top of that, uh, taking this to, back to Grand Finals to see if he can actually take uh, Marky Moo out this time around. Okay, drags him back onto the stage. Now you come up here. <laughs> he said, yeah, I want some more of that smoke. Let's go. All right. Radish needs to make some magic happen right here. Repick up of the weapon, too. Doing a lot of weapon tossing here. Radish looking slightly lost on what, what to do on offense right now. Oh, trying to ride out on, but no, just getting scooped Ooh, up. Ooh, this is Hold scary. Up. Sandstorm couldn't get that neutral air to hit. You know he would have dragged him right back off stage. Oh my gosh, yeah, and he's pressing first, so uh, Sandstorm just gets to whiff punish in some of these positions right here. This is sidelight Sarah. It's not enough to do it, but this position is quite good for Radish. Finds it off the gravity cancel. Of course, we are going to last stock game five. Radish. One uh, more stock away as well to get himself into the grand finals. He has to make a crazy comeback to do it, and I don't know if he has that much time left. Uh, we are in the red already. Small blast zones on this stage. That's not going to be the one he wants. No weapon in hand. And oh, what are we doing? He threw a Active back. input. Please. Sandstorm. Maybe a little bit of a showcase right here on mm -hmm. how the weapon works, but will his hubris get the better of him? It's not looking likely. Radish in deep red right now. Has to peer into the orb and cast a spell to make some magic happen. It starts with a Sarah. Here we go. Oh. Well, okay, getting slung off that stage oh, and all the weapon toss. Yeah, Stop. in the winner's side set for this Three, bracket. Two, but grand finals one, and the momentum oh. that Sandstorm can carry into this could be an entirely different beast. Let's find out. So Broby hitting that 3-1 on him. Okay, mm -hmm. that's, what, that's, the, that's the way this goes. When the Sandstorm won, uh, I said that like, like on the true Spanish stuff. It was the 3-1 also. A Sandstorm. <laughs> like, that's what you, be, you be doing Duolingo. A little too much. <laughs> too much, like, bro. So it was also 3-1. So all right, so whoever, when I see the two, that's why I know. Like, that's why I know who <laughs> Times wins. have changed. Yeah. yeah. Here we go, though. And, of course, the Mordex Ditto will be coming through Sandstorm, striking first right there with a wonderful first stock, staying only in the yellow. Yeah, that was. Uh, that's how you do it. Immediately popping off at the beginning. Man is looking quite healthy. Hey, Marky. Uh, you know, again, though, has to warm back up into this, uh, into this set. He hasn't been uh, playing for a bit. Sandstorm's already done two sets. Keep that going. Mm-hmm. Okay, Marky regaining action bull. Off stage now, weapon throw, makes the jump happen from Sandstorm. Nothing left right there, and Marky moves, scouts that out perfectly, a stock in response. 
Talk about it too. I mean, uh, stock and response and not taking too much damage right. uh, while taking that stock. While, you know, he kind of got bodied in that first stock, but he says, you know what, I can get back in this game pretty quickly. However, hasn't been able to find a, uh, a stock since Sandstorm has come, or a hit since Sandstorm has come back. And so there's that uh, lead starting to, to develop again. He got Gauntlet v Gauntlet coming through right here. Sandstorm getting the action started. Send and Marky move, finding that dodge once again. I mean, that has been Sandstorm's trademark certainly here. Unarmed, just going to go dip for the recovery. I mean, there was no weapon spawn to be found, so why not take a stock? I think that's a pretty good trade to me. Sandstorm now looking like that's the GOAT that I was expecting to see in the first set, but like right now, he's definitely like the GOAT. Uh, in the current part of the set, almost got a nice little uh, con conversion from Marky Moo there. Marky Moo trying to once again whittle his way back into this game, and something about him losing that stock and having to get back into it where he starts playing at 110%. Right. Gets the throw over. Sandstorm fighting away from oh that situation. Jeez. Are you, he chased Dodge weapon throw down towards him? That was nuts. What the? I mean, and went with the uh, unarmed combo there, too, to go ahead and keep it going. Could have got a bigger punish there from Marky Moo, but unfortunately. Uh oh. Weapon dropped here. Marky Moo saw the sweat beads. Managing those resources once again, but the slide charge break dance is enough to do it. Marky Moo hanging in there on this first game, but has to play this one pretty perfect. Okay. Jab him again. Where are you going? Okay. Hit him right in the dome with that one. Ooh, big swing right there. I mean, I don't blame Sandstorm. What's the punish, though, for Marky Moo? Okay, he's looking for a lot. Marky Moo, no. You know, still can potentially take this first game. Just has to find uh, a couple of a couple of strings here, and that's the way you started. They're both looking for the same thing. Yep. Nice chase down <laughs> again from Sandstorm. Out of getting hit. <laughs> All right. So far, Mar Marky gets back onto the because I know him like that, Marky. You know. We call him Mark. Yeah, we also. call him Mark. We call him Mark. We don't. We call Marker Mark too, for what it's worth. But uh, yeah, we definitely call Mark. Moo Mark. All right, Moo Man. You know what I'm saying? Like my, <laughs> my guy. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> Sandstorm. Yeah, call him Storm. <laughs> <laughs> That's what cool guys want to call them. Yeah, I've got to call them by the full government, though. So, yeah. LG Sandstone to be exact. That's, that's true, yeah. All right. Okay, out the way, I always want to see somebody punish that with their own. They're saying, like, if it's a mirror. Yeah. I'm like, all right, you just deal it back to them and see what happens. But Sandstorm is going to be able to get that uh, stock first. Got a lot of damage on to him, though, but no weapon here in Marky Moo's hand. So, managed to get that one immediately. Oh, there it is. Yeah. Nice. Caught the, caught the uh, air dodge back down to the ground. So, it's going to be guaranteed off that second side light recovery. And yeah, doesn't let the game get too far away from him. Wow, Sandstorm just bringing the action to him unarmed. Now we go Scythe v Scythe for a second. Intense neutral for just a moment. Wow, how did that dead zone right there? I'm surprised nothing hit. Okay. Scooped up. Sandstorm. Yeah, once again, I'm now we're playing just a little bit of neutral here. Just yep. a slight bit, you know? Uh, but we are, it is a very high stakes match, obviously. Grand finals here. No one wants to uh, go out. Marky Moo wanting to end the game, uh, the tournament right here. Sandstorm trying to get a reset. Oh, nice. Nice re pickup of those uh, weapons. He's got to drag, grab that like bottommost hitbox. He couldn't oh, grab yeah. him. Thought those were all on the ground. Wow. Ooh. Catches with the recovery. I mean, that was a bit on Marky Moo for trying to challenge on the way down. So Sandstorm capitalizes right here. And this one is the tiebreaker game because uh, I was I was sundowning before, yeah. unfortunately. So I forgot what uh, what year it was. Yeah, the flex game. <laughs> the the flex game. That's why I was like, say, well, in, in games where like the, the map definitely matters a lot, the, yes, uh, the third yeah. game is the flex game because if we go to that fifth and have to play on your choice, I know that's going to be a little rough. So. That's fair. And well, it looks like we will, the flex game will be going over to Sandstorm. for Sandstorm or Trial of Freya will have its champion in Marky Moo. We'll find out in three stocks or more. One more. We don't know yet. Yeah. Yeah. It'll be three to 15. Um, <laughs> three, three to five. Three to 15, yeah. Three to five stuff. It's going to be uh, quite a bit going on, but boom, boom. Mm. Okay, we're getting a lot of uh, damage here on the board from Marky Moo. Still trying to catch Sandstorm on the way down, but yeah, Sandstorm has definitely been moving around on how he decides to dodge. Quick recovery to get back to that wall. Don't know if that was the dab oh. that we needed, but uh, man, love the way they're always able to fight back out of these like, yeah. scary situations. Uh-oh. Not enough to take him off, but he does get him unarmed. Uh, Sandstorm immediately dropping down into that weapon, though. 
Yeah, pretty lucky positioning right there for Sandstorm. Nonetheless, recovery comes through from Markimu. Will not connect. Scoop. Sandstorm with a big swing right there. Catches it with the throw as well. Markimu still a few resources left and is able to touch right here. Unarmed recovery, not enough to do it. So this is another ch chance right here. Unarmed recovery right there. Not going to be able to do it either. I think he might need to unarm into the uh, GC right. and light. However, still finds that first stock anyway. Great recovery, by the way, from Marky to avoid two weapon tosses. Still touch the... Uh, the stage and get back off the stage without getting like ground pounded or anything like that. So, gotta give it up to him on that. And now Sandstorm definitely trying to find his way into probably a recovery here. Nope, can't find it here either. Marky Mu doing a good job of tricking up when he decides to go for his uh, air dodge now. Oop. That's gonna be enough for sure, yeah. Neutral Light sends him packing. Got a little bit of damage here off of uh, Sandstorm into the yellow, but no weapon in hand. Okay. Uh oh, Sandstorm starting to activate on him right now. Got two sights in, uh, on his side. Odin's drop definitely hits him up too as well. Gives him a sight. And with the weight from Sandstorm, it's getting a little scary for Marky on the second stop. Nice little pullback there on that. Uh, well, yeah, he's been doing that a lot though. And I'm surprised Sandstorm hasn't really caught on to it. Maybe he just doesn't want to hard commit to that corner mm -hmm. just yet. But Sandstorm's pullbacks right here have been really, really good. And once again, yeah, you saw him try to dash back off the stage on the left side. Playing so, so patient right here, not giving Sandstorm really a lot to go with. Yeah, well, the Weapon Star is going absolutely foolish right now. Can he still can't get over there. Sandstorm once again. Marky Moo has been unarmed for some time. And Odin is not helping him out either. That's Every right. time he gets hit off the stage, they're like, here's another weapon for you, Sandstorm. Okay, final stock comes through on the respawn, the Weapon Star, the longest of all time. It is a famine out here, mm -hmm. but Marky Moo finally picks up the gloves for a second. Eating just a little bit, bro. They finally gave him some meat and potatoes. Mm. Uh oh. Now, can he? Oh, okay, threw it away, but. Gravity cancel Just comes enough. through, and it's. Yeah, we're going to final stock. Game five. We could have our champion right now, and Marky Moo has brought this all the way back. All right. Marky Moo. Trying to make his way down to the ground, managed to do it. Tries to get that uh, gravity cancel in light, but a little too uh, high up. Managed to get back to the stage in time. Sandstorm, though. Definitely in full stage control. Ooh. Oh, big whiff right here. This is the chance Marky Boot could need. That was uh -oh. the ground pound from Sandstorm. Not going to amount to too much unarmed. Gets to pick up the sight now. Okay, gets to move out of there. Sandstorm moving on him. Oh. Looks for yeah, looks for a big dodge right there. Throws him off the stage and out of that weapon. Has to dodge through. Sandstorm not trying to put too much more pressure onto him, though. Just grabs weapon again. We're going for a weapon starve. Oh, oh no, but the platform moves, so he didn't get to get it, but it doesn't even matter. So Sans far, Gamer Lean, so far that your face is touching the screen. You're not even looking at the screen at that point. You know, you're looking you're at in the it. floor. Yeah. <laughs> <It's> like... <laughs> All right. Sandstorm now on his last chance at uh, continuing his tournament life here uh, and potentially trying to uh, win the tournament if he get, wins three straight, but it has to be all on Marky Moo's doing uh, now. But Marky Moo, yeah, that last, that first, or the second game, he was truly uh, running away with some momentum. Like, those first two stocks took before he even lost his first one, and uh, he was getting a lot of good reads in there as well. I agree. I agree. But Marky Moo showing that they are definitely a force to be reckoned with right here. So here we go, unarmed. Weapon spawn all the way on the other side. Gives Sandstorm a little bit of breathing room for now, but not for long. Recovery will disarm right here. Sandstorm picks up the scythe. It looked like that second recovery was going to connect, but still hanging on for a little bit longer. Okay, my boy is definitely moving right now. Marky Moo, the damage that he's able to put onto Sandstorm already, but Sandstorm now in the deep red himself. Can't really survive too much more. Yeah, you know, everything that he's going to be looking for. Nice little juke, the weapon toss. Man, I mean, Sandstorm's oh, wow. recoveries have been insane, though. This weapon toss is not going to be enough, but across the stage is going to be enough. That's Man, right. still double tapping on his dome right there yeah. with the weapon tosses, though. It's funny. The alley-oop to yourself mm -hmm. off the heezy is crazy. So Marky Moo with a bit of a unique little edge guard situation right there. I love to see it. Definitely feeling themselves a little bit right here with one game to go before being the Trial of Freya champion. But, I mean, you can't count Sandstorm out yet. Not at all. Sandstorm, though, does have to do a little more damage than what he's got on the screen. As I say, you know, for the most part, Marky Moo has been a lot more effective. <gasps> at, I thought I was. Yeah. If he got that right there, I was going to play. He's been a lot more effective at when he takes those stocks. And that would have been a crazy time to say that sentence <laughs> as he takes it in orange. But we are <laughs> we are definitely trying to see if Marky Moo can finish it off right now. And we're one more stock away. TK. I don't I don't like that I'm seeing this right this now. Is a, like, this is a three for the viewers at home. <laughs> 
Toast bought a little gadget that he thought was cool. It's a giant screen, and now we're only looking at the production team. In so. the command center. <laughs> It would be cruel if they did this to us over the gameplay. <laughs> we can't see funny, it, but to be honest. Yeah, so we're going into potentially last stock right here. Marky Moo, of course, approaching deep red right now. So Sandstorm should be able to hopefully get this one, I would imagine. Looks for it with the recovery. But Marky Moo looking inevitable, my friend. Oh. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, I mean, undeniable is, is an understatement right now. We might actually just see a straight up three stock with the way that Marky Moo is moving on Sandstorm right now. The red is out for, uh, for Sandstorm. He finally finds himself a uh, neutral light to get that stock. But is it too little, too late? It's definitely feeling like it. It's looking very tough. We have seen Sandstorm go GOAT mode activated, but I do not know if he has enough runway right here, even with this Scythe. Sandstorm, a little bit of action right here. Marky Moo, just a couple single swings is probably enough to close out the tournament right now. But he's playing it real well so far. Wait a minute. We were talking about goat mode. It, it might be activated. I what think is it's going, going on? It's goat season, though, TK. Hang on for a second. Sandstorm, signs of life right here. That was a perfect stock, but you need one more. A single tear is coming down to Toast's face right now, bro. Like, I... <laughs> he was... <laughs> he wants to be done so bad. <laughs> it is so late. Sandstorm is playing so well. He's playing his heart out to ruin the lives of our production team. He cannot be denied. I don't know if the recovery is going to come through, the but Marky was still unarmed. Marky is this throwing it? He doesn't know what to do. He's yeah. like, wait, the GOAT mode has been activated. The there GOAT it is. mode is oh. deactivated, TK. That is the end. Our dreams have been ruined.